Oh my god, that didn't hurt as much as the first take. Ah. Uh. Hello. This is a very different video from the type of videos that I normally make. Yeah. This one's talking about the stereotype that Muslims are terrorists. If I uploaded this to YouTube, will it be demonetized? Yes. Yes, it would. Anyway. Did you know that 45% of white Americans think that Muslim Americans are on the violent side? 51% of people involved in this study said that Muslims in general are violent. It's not good, America. Or United States. I'm pretty sure the study was taken in the United States because it says Americans. And I'm guessing Americans means the United States. Anyway, most Americans believe that Muslims are untrustworthy as well. The funny thing is, people who thought Muslims were violent seem to be untrustworthy themselves. Muslims and Muslim Americans were more on the hardworking side and the intelligent side of the survey. Now here's a like little little cartoon I found while researching for this group project. It shows that a Muslim shooter is equal to 1.3 billion Muslims held responsible. A black shooter is just a gang related violence. A professional shooter, this is in America by the way, because in Australia, we don't have guns at your disposal to just buy. That's how the last three actually have guns in the first place. One of them is a police officer. If you've seen a police officer in Australia, they do have a type of gun, but it's still not technically a real gun. And they don't pull it out every five seconds. And don't have like... Where's an example I can... I'll use a portal gun. If you guys know what portal is, it's just a game. It doesn't matter. In America, because they're so scared of, like, attacks or something, they actually, like, in Times Square, for example, they have guns, and they're just holding them across, like, big machine guns. Obviously not looking like this. This is a prop. But they have, like big machine guns and they hold it like this and they guess they're ready it's actually crazy also so yeah anyway professional shooter equals a national hero or collateral damage a white shooter is a lone wolf or parking problem at emotional issues or dot 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 and doesn't finish the sentence but, yeah, it shows that Muslim shooters, uh, there's 1.3 billion Muslims held responsible. Non-Muslims make up the majority of terrorists in the United States of America and Europe. This stereotype is making it harder for Muslim kids to live. Now, obviously, it's not like to actually, like, they're not going to get shot. Well, at least they shouldn't be. That would be dumb. Kids would be bullied at school just because they're Muslim and they could be a terrorist. What's good is many Muslim community groups have set up special camps and events for Muslim children to go to and bond with everybody, which is just fantastic that they can actually do that. Um, here's a bibliography, I guess. You can check it out. You can check out the links. I don't know. Um, I wonder if my hair's good. Nope, still putting on the hat. That's why I have the hat on, by the way. I don't normally wear hats inside. It's just that my hair... My hair's... Not... It's not good. I don't know how to end this, so, uh... Bye. Go away. Go. Shoo. Ugh. Ugh. I can't believe